Shift, preserving natural capital, inspiring community solutions. Shift is an annual festival held each October in Jackson that seeks to inspire communities like ours to preserve the natural capital essential to our economic success. On Friday, October 11th at the Center for the Arts, Shift debuted with a foodie event of the year. It's really about crowdsourcing solutions for future generations. How do we maintain our natural capital here? How do we preserve our fragile food system in this high altitude environment? The answer began with Slow Food Slowtoberfest, a celebration of local food and drink. Half a dozen leading Jackson Hole chefs created seasonal plates from locally sourced ingredients, while demonstrations on how to butcher a pig, make pasta, and transform cheese curds into hand-pulled mozzarella were conducted on the center stage. When you buy a beef from us, you'll know it was born in Jackson, bred in Jackson, butchered in Jackson, never left the valley, only ate grass and bring water its whole life lessens your carbon footprint. You help employ a, a local butcher shop, a local farming operation, wildlife habitat, contribute to clean air, open space in the valley. Following the feast, a foodie film festival culminated in a presentation by Jackson Hole entrepreneurs Nona Yahia and Penny McBride, whose Vertical Harvest, a three-story greenhouse, localizes the concept of vertical farming. Day two started with my shift, a morning of service across Teton County. Participants removed an abundance of garbage in front and back country locations around the valley. On Saturday night, Schiff celebrated the crossroads of adventure and conservation. The conservation movement was founded by outdoor adventurers and outdoor enthusiasts. John Muir, David Brower, Marty Murray, Bob Marshall, all throughout the history, people who are personally passionate about the outdoors and who get out and adventure in various ways have led the movement. And I think we need a shot of that now. Porter Fox made the world premiere of his new book, Deep, the story of skiing and the future of snow. I looked at the, you know, NOAA, NASA, National Snow and Ice Data Center, all of the usual suspects uh, to find out what was happening with snow and climate change. And I was totally shocked by what I found. Fox's message about how skiers and scientists who are attempting to save snow might end up saving the world in the process was just one of the stories of inspiration that emerged from the evening of films and music. On Sunday, the community came together at the National Museum of Wildlife Art to tell the story of what they love most about Jackson's natural capital. Ten presentations captured everything from a beautiful ode to Jackson Hole's gorgeous and princely birds to a filmmaker's whimsical take on the Tetons. Rebecca Waters' Mongolia Wolverine Project won the $1,000 Shift Forward Award, while the audience gave the People's Choice Award to Allie Dunford and Whole Food Rescue. Capping off the evening, the Murray Center's Executive Director John Mobeck announced that the North American debut of Coalition Wild, the annual gathering of rising conservation innovators, will take place in Jackson Hole next October in conjunction with the 2014 Shift Festival. Shift even offset its carbon footprint with a donation to the Teton Conservation District, supporting biomass remediation, alternative energy use, and recycling right here in Jackson Hole. This year's series of events kicked off the Shift Festival with a bang. We're already hard at work on the festival's official launch in October 2014. We're planning a full week of food, music, speakers, and film, and we're targeting communities whose economic vitality is, like Jackson's, directly linked to their environmental quality. Our goal is to help conservation-oriented communities, organizations, and individuals worldwide develop the framework for 21st century conservation efforts. Put it on the calendars. If you care about the future of the planet, from October 6th through 12th, 2014, Jackson Hole, Wyoming is the place to be.